I visited Wiesbaden today. The plan was to meet up with a friend that was stationed on a military installation located there. Although I made it and had a pretty good time meeting up, it was a pretty good reunion. The day ended up being kind of dreary and it brought me down just a little bit. Not enough to ruin my time out. The day turning into a dreary one is the reason I look the way I look in this clip right here. But not too far up this little hill right here is where the entrance to the US Army installation is located. But hold up, hold up, hold up, pause. We'll get to what happened while I was on the installation in another video. Let's go back to the beginning of what happened today. I swear today was almost the day that I didn't do nothing. Have you ever waking up in the morning and it's just like, why am I even awake? I don't want to do nothing today. I feel lazy as fuck. That was me today. You know, I think anybody will tell you that even when you ever get into these funks like that, it's best to get up and do what you need to do anyway. And personally, I find that whenever I operate off something like that, at the end of it all, when it's all said and done, I usually find myself happy and glad and just a little bit more proud of myself that I was able to get up and do it. Now obviously there's just too much goodness to dwell on the low points of this video. Take this river for instance. As I've exclaimed in many videos before, just seeing the water makes everything better for me. Plus I could always just focus in on seeing something different and something new. Like for instance, this train and the color theme on the inside. This is my first time ever seeing this, this layout with these colors and I was just kind of blown away. It was really pretty and attractive to my eyes. I'm telling you guys right now, man, sometimes it's just the little things that matter. And I'll get into more of this later on in the video, but for now, as far as what I was feeling while I was riding, I was just enjoying the fact that the train was so empty. As I told you guys before, I'll get into this in another video as well, but so far with these travels on the 9 euro ticket, the trains have been nothing but packed, mostly on that first weekend. So it looks like traveling during the week is going to be a little bit better for me, and I'm just kind of hoping that holds up. I love empty trains. And I get it to most people that might seem like small potatoes or silly things, but those little things that I notice are part of the reason I do like getting out, by the way. I did a thing. What did I do? After months of not having an energy drink, I went and got one, oh boy. Anyway, those little things like that are part of the reasons I like getting out and seeing a lot of stuff. Because even the little things can be different than how I grew up and things that I'm used to back in the States, back in my hometown. So yes, I, turn, I find a way to turn even the little things into something exciting. Sue me. So if you think about it, yes, when you see things like that, everything, every little thing has the potential to be something special something fun something exciting this looks like brand new banks and hotels over here in the Wiesbaden area i don't even know if these are being used yet it's all brand new i ain't trying to bother And so yes, even though I'm not headed anywhere special right now, I can still feel excited about going there. If you ask me, it's a very easy way to simple pleasure. Well, the rain has entered the building and outside of the building. So I gotta put the camera away, I'm under a tree. But um, yeah, looks like I gotta deal with this for a while. This looks like an arena back from where I live, back in Arizona. Pretty cool looking. Let's go check it out in the rain. So take a look at this old tree. It's really thick, tall, and healthy. Like you can see, its branches stretch all the way around. It's a healthy tree. You love to see it. It's about to get a lot of water today.
Man, people in the city respond to rain so much differently than people out in the towns and countries. <laughs> the countrysides, I mean. Yo, check out all the bikes. Look at the bike yard. It's amazing, so many bikes. So after a slow start early on and then getting caught in the rain later on, everything ended up being okay. I made it to my destination, had a nice decent lunch with my friend, did some chit chatting and catching up, you know how it goes, and then went out and enjoyed the town a little bit more before I headed back to my house. And the day ended up being way more pleasing than it was disappointing, which goes to show, like I said earlier, the little things matter and sometimes it can be those things that actually make your day. I'll talk to you guys in the next video.